गाइस हाय हेलो नमस्ते आदाब सत्याकाल असलम बड़ा कमेंट खम आगे टू ऑल ऑफ यू वेलकम टू टूडेज क्लास एंड एज यू ऑल नो दिस इज लाइक अ सेशन वेयर विल बी डिस्कसिंग हाउ टू इंप्रूव योर मैथ स्किल्स राइट so in this session i will be telling you different skills uh, different tips and tricks uh, which will help you to improve in your mathematics right so i know many students require this and uh, if you'll follow them religiously you'll definitely see an improvement in your marks I'm telling you in your marks and the more you'll follow it the more you uh, keep on doing this practice again and again that will definitely uh, make you a topper as well if you uh follow it with your open heart all right now before i move ahead guys let me tell you one thing that you know this is today is the last day for the vedantu z fest 31st january so you are getting say 50 percentage off up to rupees 2000 cbse 9th term 2 full syllabus coverage will be available to you just at rupees 3000 with the coupon code what is the coupon code gpe pro all right for grade 10th term 2 it will be available with the coup same coupon code gpe pro at rupees 4000 and icse 10th with the same coupon code gpe pro will be available to you at rupees 7750 all right so this is the discount you are getting right now previous prices what are without ad fest see the prices without ad fest is shown to you over here as well and with ad fest also is shown to you so you can see how much you are saving and take the decision now and go for it all right so my name is gopal paliwal guys i am your math teacher of mathematics here at vedantu all right then my graduation from iit dhanbad have been teaching now from past 5 plus years taught and mentored thousands of students till now so in all this teaching process i have occurred i have seen that many students want to improve in maths they really try harder but sometimes their effort doesn't result into uh, say improvement in marks so what you should do what you should follow so that you will see improvement in your marks all right i'm talking about improvement in your marks so first thing first let's start with ourselves so every student who wants to improve in maths first thing is build confidence i'm not talking about over confidence first thing to be very uh, clear over here do not be taking this confidence as over confidence that's a very thin line between confidence and over confidence and understanding it so when you have confidence in yourself you are not afraid of losing understand this thing when you are confident about yourself you are not afraid of losing but when you are over confident you are like scared of losing you can be the you are the most scared person to lose because you are so much over confident you will like ki losing in this will be a big thing i cannot do that and in that process you don't even try so understand guys if you are having confidence in yourself you will not be afraid to lose and that's what you can realize that whether you are over confident or you are confident okay so build confidence ki yes you can improve in maths this sub this is just a subject like other subjects and this subject is based more on logic and if you'll give your time to it you will definitely see improvement in this as well all right then encouraging encourage questioning and make space for curiosity this is how you should behave in class so during the class guys ask your doubts don't worry whether the uh, the doubt is silly hai na and be attentive as well be attentive as well what many students will do they'll be like ki let the teacher teach first second time i'll say explain it again and then they listen and after that sir one more time so that i'm not talking about ki keep the teacher repeating more again and again same question my point is listen to what the teacher is telling you carefully and if you have got doubt in a particular step ask it because when you're listening when you're attentive in your class you will definitely understand it and it is very important guys that whenever you are going for a class revise what you have studied earlier what you have studied earlier first thing you should revise what suppose you are going you are having a class today of maths you should study what you did in the previous class also if possible study or take idea idea about what teacher 
will teach today that means try to be a little bit advanced as well and this you can apply in all the subjects whenever you are going for any class so i'll say na every day self study self study this is what self study is this is what is your self study completing your homework on your own revising what you have studied when you are doing your homework you are automatically doing the revision revising what you have studied and also try to read at least once even if you understand or don't understand but try to read what the teacher is going to teach in the next class right so when you when you read in advance what the teacher is going to teach in next class you get to know that what part you are facing difficulty some things are easy which you can easily understand some point you get to know that this point is difficult and then you become more attentive in the class so these are the two tips definitely follow it next is emphasize conceptual understanding over procedure it's not about how do you do it it's about why do you do it maths me whenever you are studying any topic understand the motive behind it for example you will be able to understand say for any grade 10 student say trigonometry so if you know what different formulas are if you know what are the different formulas and how you have got it then it will be easier for you to understand its usage in the questions if you know what is basic proportionality theorem what does it mean how do we get that theorem it will be easier for you to understand its application all right so that's what is very important understand the concept method to solve questions you will get automatically get it there will be some difficult questions which you might not be able to crack but there you need to focus that how the teacher has solved it otherwise most of the questions you will be able to solve just after reading the uh, concept as well okay then apply maths in real life i'll tell you this thing we used to do a lot like um, when i was in grade 11th or 12th when i went for iit je coaching so there we uh, our teacher taught us a lot of thing and you know? our mechanics is all about the things which we'll be doing so like even when we started playing cricket also if suppose if we are playing during that time so the mind will be working in that direction only that okay the ball is released now u equal to 0 the ball is bouncing okay so there is one thing called coefficient of restitution you uh, know uh, then the shot how with the speed he has done the shot so that projectile motion all these things like uh, we were able to relate and that is why mechanics me i loved mechanics all right then the, so there are different things like you you must be seeing geometry so observe the shapes around you 3d shapes observe the shapes okay this cupboard is like a cuboid this is the length this is the breadth this is a cylinder you know the the say the curtain holder this is a cylindrical this is a cylinder if i rotate it the shape what it can be so those things imagine it all right so apply maths to real life and this is like for every maths session i'll tell you this thing that implement the daily practice you should practice again and again and again till you get the whole process right and you are able to understand because the more you practice the more it will be easier there is a simple rule the more you will practice the more it will be easier the more it will be easier the more it will be fun and the more it will be fun the more you want to practice it so this cycle will keep on going the more you will practice the more it is going to be fun the more fun it is going to be ठीक है से देखो प्रैक्टिस सॉरी सी द प्रैक्टिस द मोर यू विल प्रैक्टिस द मोर इट इज गोइंग टू बी इजी फॉर यू यू विल बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड यू विल स्टार्ट फीलिंग द क्वेश्चंस इजी द मोर इजी यू विल फील इट द मोर फन यू विल हैव एंड द मोर फन यू हैव यू यू विल ट्राई टू प्रैक्टिस मोर सो दिस कीप्स ऑन गोइंग एंड यू स्टार्ट इंप्रूविंग दैट इज व्हाई इट ऑल स्टार्ट्स फ्रॉम प्रैक्टिस यू कैन नेवर हैव फन फर्स्ट एंड देन प्रैक्टिस स्टार्ट विद प्रैक्टिस यू विल फील इट इजी यू विल हैव फन You'll practice more. You'll feel it more easy. You'll have more fun, and this keeps on going. All right, take care. And yes, always show your work, not just your answers. See, it's all not about getting the answer. It's about the method. Some method will be wrong. Some method is correct. Right. So just getting the answer, people, student will be like, sir, I got the correct answer, but method is not correct, beta, because right. If suppose a particular question has a problem, answer is 45. Now 45, you can get by doing anything. Okay. है ना दैट यू कैन फोर्टी फाइव डायरेक्टली इफ आई राइट वॉट डज इट मीन की माई आंसर इज करेक्ट नो मेथड इट्स ऑल अबाउट मेथड इट्स ऑल अबाउट दी अंडरस्टैंडिंग करेक्ट गाइज सो दैट इज हाउ वी नीड टू अंडरस्टैंड द प्रोसेस 
okay then also this thing is very important whenever you want to learn any difficult subject try to do peer study one chapter you study one chapter let your friends study and teach each other whatever chapter you have learned and tell them to ask whatever doubt they have so when you do that in process of clearing your doubts your own doubts also get resolved your own doubts also gets resolved all right take care bachcho so these are some of the tips which will help you in overcoming uh, the fear of maths and making thinking uh, making the maths easier uh, before i go guys last day of vedanta zed fest gpe pro is your code to get 50 percentage off up to rupees 2000 right okay so definitely register it and ed fest is going on so have the benefit of it all right so thank you so much guys for joining the session i hope all of you enjoyed it i'll see you all in the next class till then bye bye sayonara khuda hafiz to all of you please don't forget to like the video if you have loved what i have told share it with your friends and subscribe to this channel i'll see you all in the next class bye bye guys